Man, they got some pussy in this fight game right now. So you know me and Haney supposed to fight, right? We agreed on date. We agreed on everything. And now they trying to they trying to move the date and stuff like that. The Haney's, I know y'all smart, but y'all some small bitches at the same time. Y'all 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 pulling some dirty shit, bro. Y'all trying to pull not dirty. Y'all trying to pull some slick shit, but we ain't gone for that. We already agreed to the date. That's what it is. We agreed to the date already. Why y'all not why you why y'all can't go on the same date? We agree I signed the contract. What else you want? What more y'all want? Come on, man. Y'all some bitches, dawg. The hand is some bitches. Y'all scared. Y'all scared of me. Y'all don't want me to get ready. That's what y'all don't want to do, but I'm already getting ready. So I already signed I signed the contract for the date already. The date is already in the contract. Y'all can't move it. And nigga, you ain't no big draw. I don't need you. So if you don't want to fight, go fight somebody else. Go do what you want. Go stay at 35 and do whatever you got to do. But nigga, the date is the date, and that's I'm standing on that. <laughs> Whoa there, buddy. Wow, what's good? What's good? It's the one, the only. But what do, what do I know? Boxing coming back at y'all with another one, man. So we got Regis Pro Gray, Regis Rugaru from New Orleans, Louisiana. All right, so you know he's going in. He seems a little frustrated, rightfully so. Boxing can definitely get you to that point. All right, so in his, so what he's saying is basically, I, I don't know if you guys remember, but Regis and um, Devin Haney were going back and forth at a post. Devin Haney was talking about trying to fight in November. And Regis said, you know, you already know I, I, I can't fight in November because he's supposed to be out of the country at that time for whatever reason. Don't know why. Um, but he was saying, uh, you know, you said you initially said October. Let's keep it October. So now it seems as though, you know, it's a hold up in Devin, Team Devin Haney. Uh, looks like they want to move the date for whatever reason. I don't know. Uh, I would have to wait for Devin Haney, this team, Devin Haney or his team, Bill Haney, to speak on that. Um, but what I do know is, man, like they, they, I definitely want them to get this fight done. You know, um, one thing about it is with a contract and, and, and to reach his defense, I can understand his frustration because it's like, bro, if I sign the contract, bro, for a, a specific date, you can't move that date after we sign. The, the, it's in the contract for this date. So why are you trying to move the date now? So I, I, I see what Devin, I see what Regis Progray is saying, and um, I see, I, I can see the frustration um, coming from him. Like you know, look, bro, what's what's taking so long? Because Regis, I mean, truth be told, I mean, whether whether people want to admit it or not, bro, Regis Progray is correct, man. Like um, Devin Haney is. Though he's a, a fantastic fighter, a great fighter, um, he's not a big draw. So it's not like Regis, and then it's not like Regis really, you know, it's not like Regis is fighting for any of his belts. So it's like Regis is more so like, bro, either if you if you ain't if you ain't shitting, then get off the pipe. You know what I'm saying? Like, cause you wasting my time when I could be trying to make this fight with somebody else. But I don't I don't know. Again, we would have to hear what Devin Haney has to say. But I do know that they had this issue um, over Twitter at first where Devin Haney. They were, Devin Haney was trying to say in November, and Regis was like, nah, you already stated in October, you know I can't make it in November, so let's not, let's not try to pull that game, nah, let's, let's stick to the game plan, bro, and, and make this fight, um, like we said we were going to. Now, as far as, uh, him calling, uh, Team Haney some biatches, I, I, I disagree, I don't think Team Haney is afraid of Regis Progray, Regis Progray has really not shown anything to be necessarily afraid of. Uh, although Regis Progray is very skilled and a very, very talented fighter, uh, and, uh, and as well as I do believe that if Regis catches Devin Haney in the later rounds, if Devin Haney gets fatigued, Regis could stop Devin Haney. I do, I do believe that. But however, um, Devin Haney has not shown me that. If Devin Haney, has show, if anything, Devin Haney has shown me that he's definitely uh, been wanting to fight. Um, is me is is. is you know the top top level composition you know uh he called out lomachenko for years he's been calling out tank davis um he didn't seem you know too interested i don't know what's up with him in in, in shakur i don't I, you know I'm, I'm you know but um he definitely has been uh looking tia Fimo. he's been calling tia Fimo. like he's definitely been looking for the top level composition so i i don't i i said composition opposition or competition i just put them two words together but um i i don't know i don't i don't necessarily know um what uh what what what's going on i mean again i like i said i just have to 
I have to hit exactly here from Devin Haney's standpoint. But, you know, all the, man, I just really hope that this fight is getting made because this, this year so far for boxing is just on a steamroll. I feel like this has been the best year for boxing since 2017. And, um, and, and, and these two, I think, I think these two styles make for an interesting matchup. Seeing, all, it all depends, though, on how Devin Haney looks at 140, you know. Like I, I stated in videos before, if Devin Haney doesn't, um, if he doesn't, if he doesn't tire out, if he doesn't fatigue, like how he was doing at 135, and who knows, that could possibly be the reason why he was fatiguing because he was struggling making 135. Uh, we do know that weight was an issue with Devin Haney. It's no secret to that. So um, if Devin Haney uh, can stay in condition for 12 rounds without fatiguing or whatnot i think Devin haney would uh can, would win a decision but the thing about it is regis ain't no joke and he got some pop in his punch and i uh i do feel i feel like why i feel like Devin haney would outbox regis because it's not too many people that i feel like can outbox Devin haney i don't i think it's safe to say we know regis program cannot outbox Devin haney um Matter of fact, the only person that I feel like is on Devin Haney's level as far as if, if, if they're just gonna if gonna box and believe people might not believe this, but I think Tia Fimo, I think Tia Fimo has enough athleticism to carry him through a Devin Haney fight or whatnot. But um as far as as far as uh Regis go, I I, I don't think Regis um has the athleticism of a Devin Haney. Uh, I think Devin Haney is faster. I think Devin Haney is sharper. I think Devin Haney's reflexes are better. Uh, I do. I think Regis is 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 uh, has. Uh, it's obvious. I think Regis has more pop in his punch. So that makes Regis a, a a more dangerous fighter as far as the power goes. But outside of that, I think Devin Haney is the more dangerous uh, or, or the, the the more complete boxer uh, of the two. Um, but albeit. If Devin Haney's just not gonna be there for, to to get hit, you know, well at times because at times he he does stay in the pocket a little too long. But regardless, man, uh, um, I don't think that Regis can outbox Devin Haney, but I do feel like Regis can beat Devin Haney when a fight against Devin Haney. Um, it just I mean look, it just all depends. Regis is a a, a southpaw and good head movement. He, um, and as a dog, he comes to fight. Regis comes to fight. Um, maybe uh, movement gives Regis issues. Uh, or it could just be that uh, his Regis' last opponent just really wasn't daring, trying to. Uh, he he wasn't trying to. He, he didn't fight like he was trying to take the belt from the champ. He was fighting like he was trying to defend the belt um, and get a victory. Uh, and that's that's just not how you come into somebody's home to win a fight. But I still think that this. Um, I just I just I think that this makes for a very 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 good intriguing matchup. So. I, I hope that they can get to through whatever issues that they can get through because it was so uh, for this fight to not be made, um, especially as far as Regis is concerned. He says that the, the date is already in the contract, so the date is already in the contract. You know he um, he he wants the fight to be made, so make the fight happen, bro. Like whatever you know. I, again. Devin Haney needs to come. I, you know, I wish that they would do that too, bro. I really wish that these fighters like would come out and say like, "Hey, what's what's the problem?" Instead of just being quiet and it, it, it just, you know, it's it's just I don't know. It just leaves us like with nothing to defend. Like, you know, if I want to defend Devin Haney, I don't have anything to stand on. I can only go off of what Regis Progress said. If y'all have the the date in the contract. You know, why are you not abiding by that date? Why are you trying to sign it? Why are you trying to change the date? Because if Regis agree to it and sign his contract and then you guys are trying to what, put something else in there and kind of make it seem like you, you're moving the goalposts you know it kind of it makes it seem like you don't really um want this fight but i don't think that's the case with young with, with devin haney i don't think that's the case so i i hope that devin haney speaks on this soon or team haney um speaks on this soon but you gotta clap back the man called your team a biatch and we don't rock like that. I, don't, I know Devin Haney ain't, ain't no biatch at all. So I want to see that. Regis has been calling out these big guys, man. He, he called out Tia Fimo. Tia Fimo doesn't seem interested. Albeit Tia Fimo has, you know, I think he's going to more so wrong with I just beat the guy that, that um, the only guy to put a, a one on your resume I beat, you know. But I still feel like t t uh, Regis would give Tio a good fight, you know. I don't know if he beats him, but I, I think he gives Tio a good fight. Because, I mean, like I said, people don't like Tio, but... T.O. freaking dog, bro. That man is that man can box. 
very great skills. So, you know, I, I don't know, man. It's, I'm just I'm just rambling now at this point, just speaking my mind, bro. But I, I mean, listen, Devin, can you respond? Can we get a response from Team Haney, bro? I mean, because, you know, like I said, if I'm trying to defend you, you're not giving me anything to defend. You know, when the man says, hey, we, uh, we signed a contract, buddy. We waiting on you, all right? So let me know what you guys think. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. Who would you like to see each guy fight? What do you see in, out of this fight? Who do you see winning? But what do I know?